New this morning, spousal support is crucial during the divorcing process, and this has certainly been in the news big time with some big stars recently. Joining me to discuss what their deal is and, and what you can do is Petra Center this morning from Sedoma Law. Petra, it is uh, nice to see you this Tuesday morning. Good morning, Jason. How are you? I'm doing very well. Thank you. Uh, this is interesting. So it, even in the last couple of months, Petra, there have been some big names with some big time big. spousal support cases that we've been talking about here. And I want to mention them quickly and we'll kind of break down what this is. But you've got Dr. Dre, uh, who, whose um, wife, Nicole Young, seeking two million dollars a month. Among million, people yeah. in spousal support, you got Larry King and his estranged wife, and then uh, Cardi B and Offset uh, going through a divorce. So we're going to cover some of these, but I want to start. Um, what is spousal support, Petra? So spousal support are payments made by one spouse to the other to help them meet their monthly budget. Um, and depending on the state that you're in, you know there could be a, a premarital agreement that would have some control over what that amount would look like. There's a, a handful of states that have support guidelines. North Carolina is not one of them. But if the parties can't agree outside of those things, then it really is up to the judge's discretion what that number would look like. Um, on a temporary basis, there's not a lot of time often to really get into those numbers yeah. and try to figure out, you know, if Dr. Dre's wife really does have 9000 or $900,000 per month and entertainment expenses. Um, and you often don't get to start unpacking the details of that until you're much later in the case and analyzing and figuring out exactly what falls into a $900,000 per month entertainment budget. I mean, that's unbelievable. And so, so theoretically she could, she's asking for 2 million a month. And so whether it's 2 million a month or $2,000 a month, it's basically based off the lifestyle that you have kind of become accustomed to. And a lot of people, whether you're famous or not, you may have given up your future, your plans, your career based on the lifestyle that you had, and now you don't have that anymore. Is that kind of how everything is weighed? Well, that's her argument in the case that, you know, uh, and I think in, in Larry King's situation as well, um, the argument is that they gave up some career potential on their own to support their spouse, and now they want to duplicate that lifestyle. But, you know, there is the, the opposite side of the consideration, which is, you know, uh, are there liquid funds to pay that type of monthly support amount? Is that even possible? And so that's where when you get towards those uh, later stages and you're actually you know, considering it on a permanent basis and you can really get into analyzing the numbers and what that means because sure, I'm sure Dr. Dre has done really well for himself, but does he have the ability yeah. to pay $2 million per month? Uh, Paige, I want to talk about Cardi B and Offset really quickly. Uh, not a long marriage uh, with these two. Um, and now we're talking about intellectual property. How, how does their case just a little bit different? Well, uh, she had made a pleading and, and asked for support, but then retracted that and said she really didn't need it. Um, and even in a short marriage like this, they were both hitting a real stride in, in their careers at the time they got married. And reports are saying there was no prenuptial agreement. And so the deals uh, related to their music that they would have been entering around that time um, would need to be considered as part of their property distribution if either of them is looking to recover from the other in that sense. And so it's a really good idea, especially when your careers are taking off to be talking about premarital agreement. Well, Petra, listen, we could go on and on about this and whether you make millions or a few hundred, it doesn't matter. Speak to an attorney, figure out what you're doing before, during, and after a marriage. And uh, thanks for clearing some of this up. Two million a month, Petra. Woo! Hey, thanks for joining us this morning. Appreciate Thank it. We've got to take a quick break and we'll be right back.